This one is mighty interesting, right? And me and the team over here, we're just sitting and watch this play out. Now, we're going to tell you exactly what this is, short and to the point, right? This is nothing more than a blood sacrifice gone wrong. It's a massive setup. They were set up. These people left to go to a graveyard because the Titanic is nothing more than a graveyard, right? It, it was also a massive blood sacrifice. A lot of people die in misery. A lot of people die realizing that they were set up. So there's a lot of painful energy around the Titanic. Now, these people, they live in a tin can just in time for the summer solstice. And we know that the veil is very thin around that time. They left to go there to meet with entities. They left to do a ritual. And the one that left with the sun, it was a sun that was supposed to be the sacrifice, right? Remember, this is the team's perspective, right? We're telling you what we know happened, right? So when they left to meet with the entities, right? So that they can put um, the young child up for sacrifice because they believe they're going to pull it off and come back and everything will be okay. But what happened is that these entities, they double cross them right just as all the people on the titanic was betrayed and killed that is how they are betrayed and killed as well right because the ones that are their friends that is on the surface encourage them to do this knowing that when they go under they're not gonna come back right so they were betrayed and killed just like the people on the Titanic. And when they leave, they probably believe that they were going to just meet with the entities, do what they need to do, and they're going to come back and everything's going to be okay. When are you people going to learn? Do not communicate with these entities. Do not trust them. They're not your friend. Right? No matter what they're promising you. Because we know over here how oh, charming these entities can be when they want you to do whatever they want you to do they are very charming and persuasive right but well, understand these entities they betray their own and if they betray their own families what is to stop them from betraying clay from betraying man right that is what happened and another good point to pay attention is when they realize this thing is missing. The international community, they drag their feet. They drag their feet. The rescue mission, they drag it on and drag it on and drag it on. They were in no rush, no hurry to go and rescue them. Right? Because they already know how it's going to play out. They already know what happened. So we're just telling you straight and to the point. It's a betrayal, it has to do with entities, and it was a sacrifice, right? One set went down believing that they're going to do a sacrifice, meet with entities, and come back up. And another set realized that the entire tin can of individuals not going to come back. They're going to be sacrificed, right? It was a massive sacrifice. It was a betrayal, right? People, stop communicating with these entities. Stop wanting money. Soon and very soon, money won't have any value. Silver and gold will vanish away. The only thing we're going to take with us is the love of our families. That's it. Nothing else. Right? We need to seek the face of the Most High while we can. Let us pray and say glory be to the Most High.